Hi, my name is Brandon Place, uh, 22 years old from Tigard, Oregon. You know, being a professional biker does, uh, doesn't really motivate me to ride whatsoever. Um, you know, if other people want to do that, it's fine with me. But uh, I tried for a long time doing tricks that uh, you know you get recognized for, but got burned out and really didn't have any fun. And I had a head game every time I played or just went road bike, so wasn't actually having fun and being creative. So I, I try and ride really smooth, just uh, you know. It hurts less and try and make things look good and link together. I spent a, spent a while racing when I was younger and um, you know the tracks kept getting smaller and smaller and until it wasn't much fun anymore and everyone was out there to you know with the jock mentality of beating each other instead of having fun riding a tough track. So I uh, kind of got out of that and you know it just kind of stuck with me to try and make everything look smooth. And I'm not really worried about uh, being able to ride until I'm 35 or 40. Uh, I don't try and do you know tricks that are going to get me hurt or think. My daily goal is to just uh, you know not be in crutches anymore because I spent way too many times you know limping around. Uh, my right leg's a little bit bigger, I swear now. Yeah, I started riding kind of seriously at about uh, about 14 or so, and um, you know just kind of trying to you know figure out what was going on with riding. And uh, you know after a couple of years, and met up with Bruce and. We ended up getting the copy of uh, Ride On and like Head First and a couple other Hoffman videos. Um, I don't know, we watched those things like a couple times a day at least when it was raining and uh, you know, saw a lot of tricks that we probably still, you know, none of us will ever do to this day and um, I don't know, having that just kind of gave me a lot of respect for, you know, what's already been done and you know, a lot of kids these days or just anybody thinks they're coming up with something new but it's been done 10 years ago.